how are you guys doing today? Today, um, we're playing some GTA with, uh, good old Mr. Nickers here. And, uh, and today we have a story for you guys. Sorry, that's my phone. Ooh. Ah. Um, I got a text from someone. D nothing. Never mind. Um, so, basically, today I'm going to be talking about, hmm, uh, that story. Alright, so it's a story about me i'm just gonna jump right into it right now so basically i'm just gonna do something that doesn't require concentration so um basically what happened was i was at school one day and it was since i already told you that i if you don't know any background to this i'd recommend watching my latest video which is my teacher's video um that was also on gta um and the reason why it this feels kind of rushed is because it's like 11 at night and I just started recording my video and this has to go up at 12 tomorrow so yeah but I would have had a minecraft video up with my uh, new friends uh, the people in my featured channels on my youtube channel yeah I would have had a, a video up with them on a minecraft uh, world on playstation but um it kind of like m their microphone uh like their microphone, they the the voices their voices wasn't there, so it just looked like I was talking to nothing, which was really weird. So yeah, but uh, back to the story. So yeah, if you haven't watched the video, I'd recommend go watching it because the story wouldn't make much sense, I guess. So basically, what happened was I told you. Um, well, if you don't feel like watching that video, I guess this is just gonna be easier. Um than watching the video but if you already watched the video then like if you're already watching the video then I can't stop you I guess but so the teacher from my teacher's video I call her Miss Bitch she was my substitute for math because uh, my math teacher got pregnant so um yeah that's kind of what happened and I really disliked Miss Bitch that's why I gave her that nickname um so yeah basically she was just a bitch she hated me she hated me and my she hated me and my friend Justin Cause me and my friend Justin we were cool we were tight we're best friends and um you know it's like kind of sad when a teacher hates you because like you can't do anything then and you can't have fun in her class but I tried to and that's probably why she hated me so much but um yeah basically I kind of just fooled around too much in her class, probably. But, uh, so I wanted to get back at her one time. So what I did was I was, um, trying to find, because I threw my homework away. And we needed it, apparently, that I didn't know. So I was trying to look through the recycling bin. And, um, as I was doing that, I found a paper that says SHRED. A big sticky note that says SHRED in all capitals on it. Um... And basically, I, I wanted to get back at her. I wanted to, like, report this or something and get her in trouble. But later on in the story, you'll see it backfires on me. So I take the papers out. I just shove them all in my bag, me and my friend. Shove them all in our bags, me and my friend. I don't know if he's okay with me putting him in a YouTube video, so I'm just going to call him um, Tat. Yeah, I'm going to call him Tat. Crap. Tat. Tat good name um so I'm gonna call him Tat so me and my friend Tat just shoved a bunch of the papers you know the ones with the sticky note on it that said shred I thought it, we thought it was a bunch of grades and everything and so we wanted to get her in trouble and just get her like fired or something because we hated her because my friend Tat we kind of fooled around too a little bit but um yes basically um my friend Tat doesn't really, he kind of does a little bit in this, he doesn't really, he just takes the papers home and, and I just started feeling really guilty. I thought this was illegal what I was doing and everything, so I was like, crap, 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 crap. So then I came home, I am, I was gonna try to burn them, but you know, I don't know if you guys know what burn orders are, they're like, if it's, if it hasn't rained in a certain amount of time, they don't let you burn things because of the risk of forest fires. So I tried to burn it, but I couldn't, so I, I threw it all away in the garbage. And then, apparently someone told, I mean, I, I did show a 
few people on the bus. I'm pretty sure they told on me. So that's great. Um, but um, I guess that just shows to never show off things that are not, you're not supposed to have unless you trust this person very deeply. But um, back to the story. Yeah, so um, someone told on me. And the principal called me in a few days later. And, uh, yeah, I, uh, I got ISS for a day, which is in-school suspension, which I actually liked. Honestly, I really liked it. It was fun, because I got to do a bunch of, um, my homework. I did homework in advance, and it kind of helped, because then I didn't have to go to any classes either. No classes actually gave me homework, which is cool. So I think ISS is less of a punishment, but it kind of does go on your record, and people, like, see that you've gone to ISS, and then they're like, oh... He's gone to ISS. That's not good. So, uh, yeah. It was fun, though, and basically, my principal ended up making me write a report on sifting through trash and how that's not good and how that's illegal, apparently. And I said I couldn't find anything on it illegally, and he probably never actually looked through the paper. He just wanted me to write some stuff. And don't say that to me. I'm recording a video. All right, you know what? Let me. I'm going to try to get this guy. One second. Ha! Ah, he's gonna blow up. <laughs> ah, so yeah. I just ended up going to in-school suspension for a day, and having I was obviously having to be that in it for a day, and it was really annoying. And I got—I mean, I really liked it though, but you know, it wasn't that fun. And, um, yeah, everything just kind of didn't go well. And my friend Tat also got ISS for a day. And it really, I mean, ISS was fun, but the whole experience wasn't. And then that teacher hated me even more, which made me hate her even more. So, that's just the story. Don't go sifting through trash and trying to get back at your teacher. It's not going to work, because I found out those papers actually were really old. And they didn't really have to be shredded, because they were so old, apparently something I don't know I mean there were grades on there but I guess I mean unless the school was trying to cover it up which I don't doubt it because our school sucks but um yeah I, I guess that's the story so just never go sifting through trash illegally apparently according to my principal but you know I really don't think it's that illegal because it's public property I don't really know any of the laws if you want to correct me then correct me in the comments but pretty sure no one's actually going to know unless they look it up. So if you want to do some research and look it up, be all, by all means do it. But I didn't find anything where that says that's illegal. So, yeah. I, uh, I guess that's going to be the end of the video. Mm. See you guys later. Well, yeah, sorry for the short video and sorry for the story and sorry for my ugly face on GTA. But, um, I, I guess see you guys later because, you know,